Aldrich Scott, the Kansas man wanted for kidnapping missing Omaha woman Carrie Allen, was arrested in Belize and is now on his way to Houston. Allen has not been seen since November 19th. According to reports of a news station in Belize, Scott was taken into custody after embassy officials confirmed he is wanted. Scott will face extradition from Texas to Nebraska for the kidnapping warrant. If Aldrich Scott waives extradition, he would end up in the Douglas County Jail in a matter of days. If that doesn't happen, a governor's warrant signed by Ricketts may be needed. It would ask Texas Governor Abbott for the permission to take custody of Scott. That process can sometimes take months. Only on 6 News, we spoke with a man in Belize who claims that he's the one who turned Scott into authorities. Our Taylor Johnson shows us with how the two cross paths. This man, Shelton Fuentes, tells me he owns Google Grills, a barbecue restaurant in Key Conquer, which is a small island off the coast of Belize. He says that Aldrich Scott was working for him, and he even let him live at his home. Now, if you look over this way, he says that he took this photo of Scott while they were together. And over there, you can see this is the official booking photo that was taken at the local jail. And while I was socializing with him through the street, I, he was at my home like for four days. From the four days now, I feed him, I clothe him. He tells me Scott told him his first name was Nelson. So he checked Scott's information online and found that he was wanted in connection with Carrie Allen's disappearance. From there, he says he reported him to police and the U.S. Embassy. I play a role with the feds here in Belize. So the role that I play I told the people um, what was taking place with him. Fuentes told me he turned Scott in because he wanted to protect and serve, and he says he feels entitled to a reward. On your side, Taylor Johnson, 6 News.